Hello everybody, Ryan McCaffrey here from DHA with another Dave Heiner Community Diner. This month featuring Rodney Hunt and it's over 180 years of experience with Gates. Founded in 1840 by Mr. Rodney Hunt, the company's earliest products were utilized in New England's textile mills and included plows, simple wooden machines, wooden water wheels, and gates. In addition to inventing several textile machines, Mr. Rodney Hunt also pioneered use of stainless steel as a common material of construction in the 1930s. Rodney Hunt is honored to be a valuable part of the U.S. water industry. With decades of critical project experience and a presence on several AWWA committees, each project has its own unique nuances and are proud to have learned from each one of them so they can constantly improve their product in order to continue leading the water control industry. Rodney Hunt continues to manufacture fabricated gate products as it is a 180-year-old manufacturing facility in Orange Mass. Its USA-made products give them the ability to comply to certain domestic requirements and give our customers the ability to take advantage of shorter lead times. Since 1840, Rodney Hunt continues to be the largest cast iron gate and fabricates gate manufacturer in the world. The company offers an extremely comprehensive gate line with the ability to adhere to custom design requirements. With Rodney Hunt's experience design team, they work closely with consulting engineers, contractors, utilities, and municipalities to bring you the most suitable solution for your toughest design needs. They specialize in large design build gate projects and offer services such as CFD, and FEA analysis, seismic calculations, isometric views, and CAD 3D drawings, along with actuator sizing, stem design loads, and anchorage calculations. Rodney Hunt has proven to withstand the test of time by surviving a civil war, two world wars, the Great Depression, and two devastating floods and a fire. Many gates installed more than 100 years ago remain in service today. When working with Rodney Hunt, customers will experience excellence in engineering, superior quality, comprehensive product offering, and responsive service. Today's specials at the Dave Hunter Community Diner are as follows. Engineering capabilities, cast iron sluice gates, roller gates, Rodney Hunt Stocking Program, Aftermarket, and Spare Parts. Our first offering is Engineering Capabilities. With Rodney Hunt's experienced design team, they work closely with consulting engineers, contractors, utilities, and municipalities to bring you the most suitable solution for your toughest design needs. Our next special is Cast Iron Sluice Gates. A sluice gate is a cast iron vertically sliding valve having bronze seating surfaces and adjustable bronze wedges and is designed for use in a wide variety of water and wastewater applications. Sluice gates are raised and lowered with a stem or a rod using a manually operated screw stem hoist, an electrically operated screw stem hoist, or a hydraulic cylinder. Cast iron sluice gates are primarily used at the end of a pipeline or to cover a wall opening and are best suited for applications with high head, large amounts or present debris, corrosive environments, and critical in plant flow control. With a long history of successful performance, many Rodney Hunt cast iron sluice gates installed more than 100 years ago remain in service today. Here's a closer look at a 3D cast iron sluice gate. Now for some variations in types of gates. There are many variations of sluice gates that can be furnished with flange or flat frames, which are the mounting services of the sluice gate. 
All sluice gates can be furnished as self-contained gates in which the operating device is mounted on the yoke of the guides. Most sluice gate applications using a rising stem in which the threads are the operator and the stem moves up and down the gate. So what is a practical size for a sluice gate? The largest gate Rodney Hunt has made measures 16 feet by 16 feet, which is about the largest size of a sluice gate. As well, a gate can be as small as four by six inches. The maximum head under which a sluice gate can be used depends primarily on the type of application and the size. Sluice gates can be designed to withstand seating heads of 200 feet and unseating heads of 100 feet. Although, for heads greater than 80 feet, seating and 50 feet unseating, the sluice gate manufacturer should be consulted. For extremely large sluice gates, or if the sluice gate is used under an unusual condition, some modification will be required to make the sluice gate suitable for that service. When possible, the use of non-rising stems should be avoided. Any debris and rubbish jamming into the thread creates wear and makes the gate very difficult to operate. So, where would you find Rodney Hunt's cast iron sluice gates? These gates can be found in intake wells, water filtration facilities, pumping stations, irrigation and drainage canals, water and sewage treatment plants, dams, flood control, thermal power stations, and water cooling plants, and in many other facilities throughout the world. Next on our menu is roller gates. Rodney Hunt's roller gates are often specified for large openings, such as a 12 foot by 12 foot or more, or as a control gate on the crest of a dam. Wheels are employed to reduce the operating thrust. Rodney Hunt's roller gate is designed to control flow and reduce operating loads of large openings, high head applications, or where frequent operation is required. Permanently lubricated stainless steel wheels are mounted on each side of the gate and operate on rails, which are mounted on each side of the opening. The roller gate is designed to reduce the operating thrust with the stainless steel wheels that operate on rails. The wheels are sized accordingly and spaced along the side of the gate to support equal portions of hydrostatic load. Here's a typical arrangement of roller gate wheels, rails, and seals. Next on our diner menu is Rodney Hunt's stocking program. Rodney Hunt is currently maintaining a stock of completed cast iron and stainless steel slide gates as well as cast iron flap gates in Orange, Massachusetts to meet the urgent needs encountered in the industry. They as well have a stock of common sized cast iron wall thimbles that are the most requested urgent ship items. Next, we have our aftermarket products. Rodney Hunt can provide replacement parts for all your Rodney Hunt gates so you can get an aftermarket part that will fit precisely as opposed to a supplier who does not have the original drawing. Next, we have our spare parts. In addition to hundreds or thousands of digital drawings, Rodney Hunt maintains approximately 1,400 file draws of hard copy records for jobs dating back to the 1930s, allowing them to accurately identify replacement parts. Remember, the spare parts are shipped quickly Rodney Hunt maintains a stock of quick ship inventory items at their facility in Orange, Mass. Quick ship inventory includes cast iron sluice gates, cast iron flap gates, cast iron wall thimbles, and stainless steel slide gates. For information on replacement parts for your existing Rodney Hunt gate, you can always call us here at DHA and check out Rodney Hunt's website and click on Aftermarket. There you will find a number of replacement parts. They have a large assortment of standard stocked items, such as wedges, thrust nuts, stem guides, gear boxes, and seals, and that's just to name a few. Rodney Hunt can also make the special order items, such as stems, which are specific and unique to each Rodney Hunt gate. 
DHA and Rodney Hunt are both here to help. Give us a call or send an email today. Rodney Hunt has a team of experienced field service professionals available to visit the site to inspect and evaluate not only Rodney Hunt gates, but any gate. The field service team can inspect electric and manual operators, hydraulic systems, and controls. Next, let's talk about their production facility. The Orange facility is spread over almost 50 acres and is geared for fast production of gates. Their facility also houses a large quantity of spare parts, wall thimbles, valves, cast iron patterns and portable power operators, and electric or hydraulic configurations for quick shipment to customers. They as well have in-house surface treatments such as blast cleaning and passivation for all parts. Next on the menu, gate repairs. Rodney Hunt's database of projects enables them to remanufacture high-quality components for existing equipment. They provide complete in-house casting, machining, welding, blasting, painting, and testing services. Each gate is hydro-tested at the facilities and Rodney Hunt's control team can evaluate, maintain, refurbish, or upgrade the control systems operating your gates, especially hydraulic and electrical control systems. Hear what Skanska's project manager had to say about Rodney Hunt. Scott Hoffman says, The Rodney Hunt stop log system was designed in a way that made it very practical to deploy. The design used common sense and simplicity, and the results exceeded expectations. Rodney Hunt has been a responsive supplier and has stood by their product, which is consistent with our previous experiences working with Rodney Hunt. Even on difficult jobs such as First Street Tunnel in Washington, D.C., so, let's get into some success stories that Rodney Hunt had. Rodney Hunt provided a customer with cast iron flap gates sized 10 feet by 10 feet. The gates provide the first line of defense during a high water event and prevent backflow. The gates are then backed up by a set of 10 feet by 10 feet sluice gates as the emergency backup system on the structure. Rodney Hunt stumbled upon a major challenge when they needed to replace a gate with minimum rehabilitation on the site itself. They designed a gate in a way that minimum demolition was required. This optimized the overall cost of installation and saved significant time too. Here's one on roller gates. Rodney Hunt installed roller gates that had an impact on the Mississippi River. They were asked to design, manufacture, and install five of their roller gates to meet the project specifications while connecting the gates to the existing control system. The five roller gates were specifically designed for a 100-year service life in line with specification requirements. The roller gates are fully operating currently as a protective barrier against Mississippi floodwaters. Here in Lake Ababaki is a 3D model success. Take a look for yourself. Thank you all so much for attending this month's Dave Heiner Community Diner. And one of you fine folks are gonna win another swag bag. That's right, guys. One of you valuable customers who have attended this diner today will be selected to win a DHA swag bag. I hope that you guys learned so much about our great manufacturer, Rodney Hunt. We really appreciate you guys being here. And for any other questions, you can give us a call at the office, 973-299-9990. Don't forget to follow us on Instagram, check out our YouTube channel, follow us on Facebook, and we will see you guys soon. Take care. We here at Dave Heiner Associates have been serving the tri-state area in the water and wastewater industry for over 44 years. Give us a call today when experience matters to you.